Hello so guys, today I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and fix your corrupted data or delete your corrupted data. So let's start off. For example, if you get a text message or a notification and stuff like that on the PS5 that you have some corrupted data, sometimes it will actually display on your home screen. So what you can basically try to do is just going to that corrupted data. Let's just say this is all corrupted data. You just want to click on start and try to delete it. Or you want to click on there and then just search up the problem and try to delete it by clicking options. If that doesn't work out guys, like on the PS4, I actually had some corrupted data on the PS4 back in the day, but I actually fixed it out by just going to settings and going to console storage. By the way guys, if you please could like and subscribe, thank you so much. Now go over to console storage and let's go over to save data. So now on here, we have PS5 games and PS4 games. So if your latest uh, game that you are playing was a PS5, play, uh, a PS5 game, you just want to click on PS5. If it was a PS4 game that you were playing as last, click on that. So what sometimes happens is, it actually happens to everybody, it can happen to everybody. So once you play like a game on the PS5 games or the PS4 games, sometimes the power just goes off and then you get like a, a text message or a notification that says your you have some corrupted data or something like that. It's probably the last game that you've played. So if it's like Grand Theft Auto, let's just delete this one. Click on here. So I'm gonna show you again, guys. You wanna go on here, this edit button over here, and then you will see this. So sometimes it will actually say that you have corrupted data on here. So let's just say that I was playing GTA 5 before my power shut down so on gta 5 you just want to go on there and you just want to go ahead and delete the latest uh, saved file that you have so you just want to look here and just go all the way down and delete the latest uh, save file basically so once you click on delete you can actually fix up your corrupted data so let's go back you can also do the same on the ps5 games Use those. You just go ahead and click on here, for example, and just delete it. So, guys, it could happen that you lose a little bit of process. It's normal, guys, but there's no other way out. So, if you have corrupted data, it could actually mess up your system itself, your PS5 itself. So, that's why it's a lot better to delete your corrupted data because basically it's already corrupted. You cannot get it back or not get it fixed out. The only way that you can fix it is by deleting it. And once you delete it, you can just go ahead and play the game again. So on here, for example, like I said, on GTA 5, once I delete it, my corrupted data will be gone if this was corrupted. So let's go back. So this was basically the video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have some more questions, leave it in the comments down below. And also, guys, you can add me. Here's my name, just Kiri. And follow me at Twitter and Instagram. Link in the description. So please like guys, subscribe, that will actually help me out so I can make more videos to help a lot more people out. And take care.